So what we have here is a uh, finished, oops, a finished mulch basin. And um, so as you can see, I've, uh, we put the, the capstone to grade here. The reason why we have this capstone on here is to protect um, what's underneath and also to protect the people that are above it as well. Um, animals, uh, children, um, things like that. So basically if there's any gray water, uh, we want to keep it underneath here. And that's why we've uh, got the mulch basin here. So this is what it looks like underneath. So we have uh, mulch all the way around here. Here's our uh, ball valve, which we can adjust one way or the other. Um, when we finally get this uh, hooked up, this is probably going to be turned down a lot because uh, it's at the beginning of the system. And we want it to be able to run uh, through the whole entire length, which uh, this is probably about uh, 250, 300 feet, um, this, this whole uh, project, uh, dumping into 29 mulch basins, uh, basically this size here. So we have mulch inside, and the water's going to come out of here, fall onto the mulch. There's like a little air gap here. It's a two-inch air gap. And uh, so it's going to saturate this area. So I'm going to put this cap back on. Now, what the homeowners are going to do, or when we finish this, rather, um, all of this is going to be covered with mulch. So you won't even see this capstone. But it's a good marker, and it's a good protection, as you can see. <coughs> Nothing's going to uh, basically uh, crush anything and uh, it's very stable and it's basically the next generation of, uh, of the mulch basins that I've come up with um, basically graduating uh, or upgrading from recycled uh, uh, plant pots uh, which weren't very sturdy at all and uh, so anyway that's it thank you for watching